I like to come to learn. I like to come to learn. I like to sing and play today. I like to come to learn. Hello guys, how are you today? I bet you are doing great. Today it is t -t Tuesday. But before we begin with our activity, let's talk about what we did last week on Friday. Do you remember? Last Friday, we talked about animals and how they move. Do you remember the videos that we watched? And you had to send me a video of how your favorite animal moves and sounds. Let's see what we got back from our friends. Esto es la perro, and esto es la gato. La gato, la gato, la gato, and then la gato. I did it! ¿Y cómo hace el gato? Meow, meow, meow. We have... Jump the frog, and then, and then we have horsey, and then we have a bear, and we have a snake. Can walk on two legs. People. Good. We're mammals. What What is the loudest animal you can think of? Dog. Nice. Wow, that was awesome, guys. Keep up the good work. Well, today is Tuesday, and that means that you and I are reading a book together. Let's go see what book we have for today. All right, guys. Today we have a book called. Good thing you're not an octopus. Ooh, I wonder what it's going to be about. We have our front cover, the spine, and the back cover. Oh, look at the back cover. So let's begin with our book. You don't like to get dressed in the morning? It's a good thing you're not an octopus. If you were an octopus, you would have eight legs to put in your pants. You don't like to put on your shoes? It's a good thing you're not a caterpillar. Hmm, I wonder why. If you were a caterpillar, you would have 16 feet to put shoes on. <gasps> Wow, that would be crazy and really tiring. Look at all those shoes. You don't like to ride in your car seat? It's a good thing you're not a kangaroo. If you were a baby kangaroo, you'd have to ride in your mother's pouch. You don't like to eat your lunch? It's a good thing you're not a bird. If you were a bird, you would have to eat worms for lunch. Ooh. Why do you think birds eat worms for lunch? You don't like to take a nap? It's a good thing you're not a bear. If you were a bear, you would have to nap all winter long. <laughs> you don't like to take a bath? It's a good thing you're not a tiger. If you were a baby tiger, your mother would have to lick you clean. You don't like to brush your teeth? It's a good thing you're not a shark. If you were a shark, you could have 200 teeth to brush. <gasps> wow. So the next time you need to get dressed, go for a ride, eat your lunch, take a nap, take a bath, or brush your teeth. Remember, 
It's a good thing you're you. Phew. The end. Wow, guys, that book was awesome. And it talked about why it's so good that you are you. Well, that book was called It's a Good Thing You're Not an Octopus. But I have a question. What would happen if you were an octopus? So right here, you're gonna need your paper. And remember, you're gonna put your name. So let me put my name on my paper. This is my name. And for your activity, for your assignment right here, you're gonna show me what would happen if you were an octopus. So how would you look if you were an octopus? Remember, the book said that octopus have eight legs so don't forget to add that detail in your drawing see you tomorrow guys i cannot wait to see what kind of drawings you send me so we can share them with our friends tomorrow bye bye